Welcome to TLH Patterns. I am Pradeepa. Today in this video, I am going to show you how to crochet these cute miniature popsicles which you can uh, use as keychains or as uh, bag charms. I use sport weight cotton yarn in four colors for the popsicle that I am going to show you here. Three for the popsicle and the last one for the stick. You can use as many colors as you want. And uh, I used a 3.5 mm crochet hook. Along with it, you will need your needle, key ring, scissors and a pair of googly eyes. You can also use beads, uh, black embroidery skein and um, fiber fill for stuffing and you will also need a stitch marker. First, let's make a slip knot. Now, make 5 chains. Single crochet in the second chain from the hook and then single crochet in the next two chains. Then work three single crochets in the last chain. Then single crochets in the next two chains on the other side. Then in the next chain work two single crochets. You'll have 10 single crochets in this round. In the next round, work 2 single crochets in the first stitch. Place a stitch marker in the first stitch of this round. Single crochet in the next 2 stitches. Two single crochets in each of the next three stitches. Single crochet in uh, next two stitches, then two single crochets in each of the two remaining stitches. In this round, you will have sixteen stitches. From the 3rd round to the 15th round, you will work single crochet in each stitch. Place a stitch marker in the first stitch, moving it up as you progress. Then work single crochet in uh, each stitch around. And um, you can change colors wherever you want. You can use as many colors as you want. I am making this one with uh, 3 colors. So I made uh, 5 rounds with uh, each color. I'll show you how to join a new color. Instead of completing the last stitch, insert hook and pull up a loop. And now you can um, complete the stitch using the new yarn. So uh, wrap the yarn around the hook and pull it through the two loops on your hook. And now you have completed the last stitch with the new color. And you can continue working the rest of the rounds using this new color.
I have completed all uh, 15 rounds. Then we can flatten the popsicle from the top and um, work one or two more stitches to bring your uh, yarn to the corner. I am working one single crochet. Okay, now I will work a slip stitch in the next stitch and then cut the yarn off leaving a long tail for uh, weaving in the ends. Now we will make the stick. Make a slip knot and uh, work 5 chains. And then work single crochet in the second chain from the hook. And in the uh, rest of the chains, this we are going to work in rows. This is your first row, chain 1, turn and work single crochet in uh, each stitch. So you will make uh, 4 single crochets. Chain 1 and turn will work one more row of uh, 4 stitches. That's it. So you will work 3 rows of uh, 4 single crochet stitches for the stick then uh, cut the yarn off. Now thread the end of uh, yarn into a yarn needle and now we are going to sew the edges together. Fold it into half and uh, sew the edges together. Then we will glue the eyes. Then embroider a smile below the eyes. When you are done with it, uh, start filling with uh, fiber fill. Don't use too much of filling, you don't want it to be rounded. Um, you want the popsicle to stay flat, so use um, less amount of uh, stuffing. We will close the opening now. Thread uh, the loose end of yarn through a yarn needle. and. Uh,
start sewing from the corner. I am sewing only into the back loops. Now we'll attach the stick, place it at the center and um, push it a little bit inside and then start sewing uh, through the stick. Then join together the rest of the stitches. Hide in the loose ends of yarn. Here are some using different colors. Use um, as many colors as you want and you can decorate it with uh, beads. Finally, sew the keychain to the top of the popsicle. 